Bonjour and welcome to the best of Tesla Tour. Today we feature some memorable, magic and delicious moments I have experienced in my 14-year journey. The coastal area around the Mont Saint-Michel is so flat that several times a year during the very high tides it all gets flooded. The resulting salty fields are an ideal ground for the local sheep to graze. It results in one of the testiest land in France. People come to the Mont Saint-Michel from all around the world to visit the Abbey, but also to taste the great speciality of the restaurant, La Mer Poulard. I am hoping that Alain Grespier, the chef de cuisine, will give me the recipe of the legendary omelette created here in 1888 by Annette Poulard. Je ne voudrais pas vous donner la recette parce que c'est un secret. Mais elle est composée de plein de secrets. Le bois, la poêle qu'on utilise, le beurre de micelle, bien sûr, qui lui donne un goût. The long musical beating of the foamy secret mixture is blissfully fascinating. The cooking on the wood fire is admirably conducted by the experienced omelette cook who skillfully plates the souffle lac concoction. To celebrate this stunning piece of gourmet theater, I indulge in a glass of Normandy apple cider. My omelette arrives, garnished with local lobster and wood mushrooms. It is a memorable experience. Merci, Madame Poulard. This baked quail with grapes and chestnut is a classic of French cuisine. First, I drop a handful of grapes into boiling water. After 10 seconds, I drain and peel the grapes. Then, I lightly brown four quails in a little butter and oil. Mix in a finely chopped shallot and one diced rasher of bacon. After two minutes, I add 100 milliliters of local dry white wine from Bergerac. I bring it to the boil and boil for two minutes, then add about 300 grams of peeled chestnuts. Next, I season with a little salt and pepper, cover with foil and a lid, and cook on very low heat for 15 minutes. Then, I stir in the peeled grapes and reheat for five minutes. Just before serving, I stir a knob of butter into the sauce. Then I sprinkle some chopped parsley over this delicious caille au raisin et au marron. On the left bank of the Seine River, the sophisticated restaurant Guy Savoie is one of the finest in Paris. The food is modern and outstanding. It is an honor for me to meet the chef Guy Savoie. Tous les pays ont une cuisine, mais la France a une gastronomie. On a les savoir-faire ancestraux, hein, c'est-à-dire que ça, ça nous coule dans les veines depuis, depuis des générations et des générations. My lunch is memorable and a chance to experience the amazing oyster dish. The red mallet is a taste of Provence. The artichoke and truffle soup, served with a flaky brioche, is one of Guy's signature dish. In our next Best of Tesla tour, we feature some of the much-loved French spirits and liqueurs.